How are you feeling physically, first of all, uh, coming off that last game? Better, better. Um, it's still hot, so. Uh, but uh, f uh, physically, I feel good. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm rested. I got good treatment from the from the staff, the medical staff. So I feel good. Are you feeling pretty close to being able to go a full 90 if, if you need to again? Yeah, the last game was already like 82 minutes, 83 minutes. So it's, it's already close, but uh, we just got to be careful. It's uh, it's been an injury six weeks, so. Um, but I think if it's necessary, I can go 90. Yeah. I believe you were former teammates with San Jose's new signing, Garam Kashia. What do you know about him? <laughs> he's a funny guy. Um, he's been my captain for four years in, uh, in Holland. Uh, we played a lot of NBA 2K together. <laughs> so uh, people will like him over there. He's like uh, a guy who's always involved in the communities in Holland. He was uh, very good with that. So he will be a big part of the community there, I think, also. Um, he, he will adapt well, and uh, he's, a, he's, a, he's a good leader. So I think if, if uh, Zen Jose was looking for a leader in the locker room, they find the right guy. Um, he's been the captain for my former club um, for eight seasons, I think, eight, nine seasons. So, and he's the captain of his country. So uh, if they, what I said, if they were looking for a leader, they found the right guy. What is it about this defense? Christian talked about it. You guys have been steady. It doesn't matter who's in there. You guys have really been steady as a defense. What are some of a couple of those things that are making you guys so stout in defense? Um, I think, first of all, uh, communication. It's, it's the most important thing. And it's not only the back line. It starts, it starts up front with Will or Clint or Rui Diaz. doesn't matter who plays. Up front, it starts over there. And uh, we try to make it compact as possible. Everybody know the, the, the rules defensively. Uh, that's why we, pre we prepare for every week. So I think uh, we're just steady and uh, everybody knows what to do. And of course, you're going to give up goals. But as long as, uh, as, as it is uh, steady all the games, uh, you, go, you always can fight for a result. And uh, the past four games, that's what we've done, even with 10 men. You know, uh, and I think in the league, if you look at the table, we, we, are, uh, we are very good as a, as a defensive team if you compare it with all the other teams. So. I think that's uh, that's what you need to look into when you talk about our defense. Has that been the, the evolution now that once you guys are compact, how you're going out and now creating chances? Has that been what's kind of changed in the last four or five games? No, it's that's always uh, been a rule. I think everywhere I've, uh, everywhere I've played, if it was the national team or final or Vitesse, it's always started with a compact defense because uh, it, it, it makes it difficult for the opponent to, try, to play between the lines. and and it doesn't stretch the pitch. It's easier when the, when the pitch is stretched to play. So I think that's the basic rule in, uh, in soccer, uh, especially now. You see it in the World Cup too. Like if you stay compact, you always have a chance. And um, I think that's what we've been doing the whole year. So I guess, let me ask it this way. Sorry, I wasn't clear. Have you guys gotten better in transition from the compact defense to the lanes on offense? Uh, I, w I, I wouldn't say it like that. I think we have, we've become better in possession the past four, the past four games. Um, I don't think we, obviously we missed Jordan Morris to play a good transition, transition play from offense to defense because she needed speed. But I think, especially the Vancouver game and the Colorado game, we were better in possession. And I think that's very important for our team because we have guys like Nico who needs the ball. And if, we, if we're going to chase the ball a big part of the game, then you lose that quality too. And I think that's, that's the more important thing when we, why we get results, we keep the ball more.